what makes it very special is just the fact that it's not based in the fairy tales or like Swan Lake or Giselle or something like that. It's, uh, it's based in something that really happened, like a, a real life event. Actually, what is very inspiring for me is this sense of freedom that these men have and this uh, um, way of guiding the whole, like, the whole crowd of slaves and to try to make a revolution. Being doing a spectacle, having the freedom of movement or way of how you manage the stage, how you you look at the audience, how you try to 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 connect and to tell the story, sometimes without many other movements or or only only with uh, like like staring staring at some corner or grabbing scarf or giving a hand or something like that. It's very it's very interesting. It's a technical and physical challenge. For every person who performs crosses or spartacus. Uh, four couples, four principals, they have a chance to dance. Usually you see one couple on stage, all the classical ballet, but this is like four couples, four strong parts for the dancers. They really enjoy to dance because it's very strong parts for all of them. Igina, Krasus, Frigia, Spartacus. And it's so enjoyable to dance. So, And what makes, for my opinion, what makes the classical alive is the people. So they make all this energy impulse for the audience and it's great music. So many good parts and interesting parts for, for even for the Cordoba, especially it's very difficult for the male dancers. It looks like not that difficult, but there's a lot of, you know, energy, you need a lot of power to produce this balance. You know, it's right energy, that's what is count. And even Mr. Grigorovich said, everybody has the right energy. I mean, we kind of, uh, what we're doing, we're going to do, uh, how you say, five-star produ product. Die Rolle ist technisch sehr fordernd, aber man darf gleichzeitig nicht vergessen, dass, dass der Ausdruck eigentlich am wichtigsten ist. Also jede Bewegung, die ich mache, ist eigentlich, um ein Gefühl zu vermitteln und um mit Krasses zu spielen, um ihn zu verführen, um ihn ein bisschen zu, zu reizen und ja, es ist eine Rolle, die mir, glaube ich, passt. Wie man auch so, so schön im wahren Leben sagt, dass hinter jedem erfolgreichen Mann eine starke Frau steht. Und ich glaube, in diesem Ballett, in, in diesem, vor allem dieses Paar, ähm, Egina und Krassus, kommt das wieder so zum Vorschein, dass sie sehr viel in der Hand hat und sehr viel im Hintergrund äh, damit zu tun hat, äh, auch über den, über den Erfolg von Krassus letztendlich entscheidet. Every time you have to go out, you have to be very prepared like physically and musically as well, because the music is so, uh, is tricky sometimes to get. I 
I think uh, if you if you believe in 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 freedom and you do and you try to do something about it and you're trying to accomplish something, then for me you're a hero.